Manchester United planning a historic squad shakeup with only three players safe from Ratcliffe's. Manchester United planning a historic squad shakeup with only three players safe from Ratcliffe's chopping board Manchester United planning. A historic squad shakeup with only three players safe from Ratcliffe's chopping board Manchester United planning a historic squad shakeup. With only three players safe from Ratcliffe's chopping board Manchester United are reportedly planning a significant overhaul of their team this summer with a reliable source indicating that almost every player in the squad is available for sale to some extent. Sir Jim Ratcliffe, a part owner of the club, is determined to transform the ethos at Old Trafford, shifting the focus towards young, talented players capable of playing exciting football. His priority is to sign the best young British talents while offloading high-earning superstar signings who have not been performing on the pitch regarding potential. Signings, Ratcliffe is optimistic about securing English talents such as Jared Branthwaite and Michael Aulis. There is also interest in Benfica's emerging midfielder Joao Neves, although his acquisition is expected to come at a significant cost. Meanwhile, a number of surplus players are expected to depart Old Trafford this summer. In fact, the Telegraph reports that Manchester United are open to considering reasonable offers for nearly every player on their roster during the upcoming transfer window. This could lead to a major overhaul of the squad, with over 10 players potentially leaving. Case Miro and Rafael Verani are both expected to move to Saudi Arabia, where they could reunite with former teammate Cristiano Ronaldo. Additionally, Christian Eriksen is set to leave, with speculation suggesting a potential return to Brentford. Anthony Marshall will leave Manchester United on a free transfer once his contract expires on June 30. Furthermore, Manchester United are willing to take a financial hit to sell Donny van de Beek, exploring all possible means to offload him. The only players guaranteed to remain at Manchester United next season are the promising young trio Alejandro Garnacho, Kobe Mainu, and Rasmus Hodgland, whom Ineos intends to build the team around. While it's theoretically possible for Bruno Fernandes to leave, it would come as a significant surprise. The playmaker has previously attracted interest from Saudi officials but he is reported to be content at Manchester United. Then there's academy graduate Marcus Rashford, whose form has dipped again this season. While Ratcliffe is not actively seeking to sell the winger, he would seriously consider any suitable offer. Paris Saint-Germain have long been linked with a move for Rashford. David Ornstein has also shared his insights on Rashford, stating that Manchester United would like to help the 26-year-old regain his best form. However, if Rashford indicates a desire to move on, Manchester United will not stand in his way. Additionally, other players Manchester United are likely to receive offers for include Mason Greenwood, Jadon Sancho, Aaron Wan-Bissaka, and Victor Lindelof, however. Manchester United will undoubtedly incur significant financial losses if they decide to sell players such as Sancho and Juan Bissaka, as their market values have decreased considerably since joining the club. The same applies to Anthony, whom Manchester United were persuaded to spend over £80 million on by Eric. Ten Huggyi. This is despite the fact that his value was estimated at £30 million when Ole Gunnar Solskjaer was in charge. The highly inefficient signing of Antony is precisely the type of transfer deal that Ratcliffe believes Manchester United should move away from. Man United could offload as many as 12 players this summer. As many as 12 players could be offloaded by Manchester United this summer as part of a radical overhaul of the squad. According to the Daily Mirror, it is claimed there is a case for moving on Victor Lindelof, Aaron Wan-Bissaka, Rafael Verani, 
Case Moreau, Scott McTominay, Mason Mount, Christian Erickson, Anthony, Marcus Rashford and Anthony Marshall, as well as Mason Greenwood and Jaden Sancho, both currently out on loan Van de Beek to. Return to Old Trafford Donny Van de Beek will return to Manchester United in the summer. According to Fabrizio Romano, the Netherlands international joined Eintracht Frankfurt on loan in January but has started. Just four Bundesliga games Frankfurt will not take up their 14 million euros, 12 million pounds, option to buy Van de Beek, meaning he will head back to Old Trafford despite being out of favour under Eric Ten Hag Van de Beek. Is set to look for another move away from United in the summer, according to Romano 10. Hag. Personally deals with Garnacho over liking social media posts criticizing manager Manchester United manager Eric Ten Hag. Has addressed Alejandro Garnacho's social media activity with the player personally, according to the Manchester Evening News following Saturday's 2-2 draw at Bournemouth in which Garnacho was substituted at halftime, the Argentine liked posts that criticized Ten Hag for throwing a 19-year-old under the bus, adding the manager was clearly scared of upsetting the bigger earners. He later unliked the posts a United spokesperson has reportedly said the matter was dealt with internally but declined to clarify. Whether Garnacho has been outright disciplined, Ten Hag has already clashed with another winger this season, sending Jaden Sancho back to Borussia Dortmund after a public disagreement over his effort in training Marcus Rashford, has also faced disciplinary action for off-field indiscretions under Ten Hag, but remains a key part of United's attack Man United. Headlines Tony linked with Old Trafford switch Manchester United have emerged as potential dark horses. In the race to sign Ivan Tony Bruno Guimaraes has insisted he is happy with life at Newcastle. As he continues to be linked with a move to Manchester United Newcastle are ready to ramp up tension with Manchester. United by going for France star Adrian Raby at Manchester United hope to steal a march in the case for Jared Branthwaite. As soon as Jason Wilcox arrives Marcus Rashford's future is at Manchester United after Paris Saint-Germain made it clear they have no interest in signing the struggling frontman Manchester. United forward Mason Greenwood could have several Premier League offers this summer Garnacho likes social media posts. Criticizing 10 Hag Alejandro Garnacho may be facing some awkward conversations with Eric Ten Hag after liking social media posts that criticized the manager. Garnacho was substituted at halftime in Manchester United's 2-2 draw at.